About 700 people in Lexington are homeless, according to a 2020 census report. The Lexington Rescue Mission is hoping to bring that number down this year using money raised during their annual Walk for Warmth. LEX 18 Sophia Millar explains how their program is changing lives in tonight's Big Story at 6. Matthew Cox lived on the streets of Lexington for years. I've been out there on night. It is so cold that you couldn't. I mean, everything you had, you have on and still sitting there freezing. He thanks the Lexington Rescue Mission for helping put a roof over his head. And they also supplied me a bed and some furniture for my living room so I'd have a place to live. Cox is one of 81 people who benefited from the mission's homeless intervention program in 2019. Supporting that program is the reason why hundreds of people turned out this morning for the 13th annual Walk for Warmth at Phoenix Park. It's growing every year, so it, you know it's amazing to see that there are this many people who would get up on a cold Saturday morning that care about people who don't have a home. All of the proceeds from the walk will go to making sure more people like Matthew Cox have a place to stay. And we use that to house families, to actually um, help them pay their first month's rent, help them be, have stable and secure housing. On February 15th, just a week before the walk for warmth, a homeless man was found dead of hypothermia under the I-75 overpass in Lexington. A sad reminder that the rescue mission's work truly can be life or death. And half the time you just up walking because you can't sleep. It's a cold you can't sleep. Because you're afraid if you go to sleep you won't wake up. It's very dangerous for people to be out in the cold, so it makes a big difference if we can get them a home of their own, you know, a safe place where they can come. In Lexington, Sophia Millar, LEX 18 News.